Hey you guys, how you doing today? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Wow, I came across a manufactured and mobile home today that I wanted to share with you. It's a listing and like real estate in the Sarasota County area on the Gulf of Mexico, mobile and manufactured homes are flying off the shelves too. But this one caught my eye because I thought it would be a perfect example for you guys to see this home. If you've contemplated buying a manufactured or mobile home, but you're hesitant because it's dated and you're not really sure how much effort or how much money or if you want to roll up your shirt sleeves and get your elbows into the thick of it. Okay, so this one is in Camelot Lakes. It was only on the market for five days and it's already pending. It was priced at $155,000, $155, so if you want to take a look at what a 1981 manufactured home looks like from in, in a modern standard, take a look at this listing and it's over on Camelot Lakes Drive. Uh, Camelot Lakes, if you're not familiar, is in Sarasota. It's about 10 and a half to 11 miles from the gorgeous Siesta Key beaches. And Camelot Lakes is a gated neighborhood and I love the gate guy there. And uh, it's a very beautiful neighborhood comprised of many, many manufactured and mobile homes. You can kind of hear the I-75 traffic from this community, but it's lovely nonetheless. They've got very nice amenities, heated pools, and clubhouses and the location is very convenient um, so you know if you're looking for Sarasota and you don't mind land lease community perhaps Camelot Lakes would be for you the land lease in this community is around 1100 per month so um, you may want to check it out but this listing caught my eye because it is absolutely very very nice I would love to shoot a video with the sellers of this particular manufactured home to ask them how long it took them and you know, just give a little bit of a guesstimate of the cost that was associated with modernizing this home. It's beautiful. The kitchen is open. It's got all new appliances, a beautiful kitchen island. When they listed this home, they did a fabulous job, all bare flooring. They use light and bright colors on the bedrooms. They used bedding that is clean, crisp, and you know, not too poppy of color, not too dated, not too florally. Um, it's just a very, very nice home on the market for five days and already pending at $155,000. So if you guys have considered a mobile or a manufactured home, but you're, you know, you're worried because it's dated, uh, and I've talked about this in my other vlogs, manufactured and mobile homes are really fun to renovate and modernize. There was another one that one of my sellers did, her name was Kelly, and this was over in Venice, and it was a 68 vintage single home, but she turned this thing into something that could have been in the coastal home. Coastal Living Magazine. It was so, so nice. She blended coastal colors and added the correct, you know, amount of furnishings, not too big, not too large. She added a private patio space on the back with a sombrella set. It was awesome. And I sold that home myself in a matter of a couple of hours after listing it. It was that nice. And it sold for between forty dollars and $45,000. And it was a 68 single. This home is a 1981 manufactured home and it's selling for $155,000 five days within listing it. So if you want to know what this home looks like, take a look at it. It's on realtor.com. It's a, it's a beauty. And it just goes to show that when you roll up your sleeves, you get your elbows or your hands dirty, and you have a little creative imagination, there's a lot to be done with a manufactured home. And this one, it's just lovely. I would love to see this home in person. I know where this home is. It's on a little bit of a curb. That location, it does have a lake view, but the location wouldn't be for everybody. But it has some beautiful palms in the front, and it's just a lovely home. And it's a two-bedroom, two-bath. So take a look at this. And, you know, if manufactured or mobile home living is one of your considerations, just know that in the Sarasota area, you have a lot of housing options and prices available to you. You have the land lease communities like this one at Camelot Lakes, and then you have real estate owned. But keep in the back of your mind that if you're buying real estate owned mobile or manufactured homes, the asking prices are going to be five to seven, eight times higher than those in land lease communities. Uh, this one you're going to pay $1,100 a month for the land rent. And, of course, these people are paying $155 or whatever it is because it won't show me what the actual cost, uh, the price, sold price is. But just to go to say, if they're spending $155,000, they're also spending $1,100 a month for the lot rent for this particular community. So if you have real estate owned, you might find this home might have been over $250,000 and you're going to have separate real estate taxes. With real estate, you're buying real estate and the land underneath it. With land lease communities, you're purchasing personal property and paying lot rent. 
Lot rents can vary throughout the Sarasota County area. You might find some lot rents below uh, maybe between four and six hundred and fifty dollars and then you're going to have lot rents above six hundred and fifty to twelve hundred dollars per month so it all depends on your location the closer you are to the gorgeous gulf of mexico the higher the cost is going to be generally and of course it d depends on the amenities now this community has a couple of heated pools the resort of bay indies community in venice off of venice avenue has three heated pools all kinds of pickleball courts, tennis courts, shuffleboard. They have their own fitness center in a three and a quarter mile walking path. It's pet friendly. Camelot Lakes is pet friendly in sections. So not all communities are created equal. So you're going to have lots of options and price points. That's, that's the bottom line, really. So check this one out. It's on Realtor.com. It's priced at $155,000. you will know it when you see it. It is absolutely beautiful. And I wanted to see if there were any others that were similar to this. Like here's one that's new construction. This one's $180,000. It's dark. Um, it's got a really strange facade. It's dark on the inside. It's a lot of dark browns, a lot of taupes, grays. And gray, I'm sorry to say, from the 2021 fashion and interior trends, gray is kind of on its way out. Not all grays, but... The trends for 2021 are going to be more homey, a little bit more traditional, earthy colors. So this one, this one, I'm sorry to say, is going to be a little dated in a couple of years. Um, and plus, it's 180,000. The one for 155 is a much more modern, light and bright, open, beautiful space. And I just wanted to see if there was any others that catch my eye that are modern, like that one there. Um, all kinds of price points in Sarasota for these homes. I just wanted to see if there were any others that caught my eye real quick, but uh, I don't know. Here's another one. This is in the same situ same community. This one is almost 80000 and I want to look at the inside of this one. A lot of clutter. When you're selling a home, you've got to remove that clutter. Depersonalize the space. Really remove a lot of the furnishings. Make it light and bright. This one's a very nice home too. A lot of furniture, a lot of stuff on the counters. It's not attractive, but this is a very nice home. And this one is priced just below 80000 So take a look at that one as well. It's in the same community of Camelot Lakes. Here's another one. This one's just priced below $100,000. let us take a look at this one. This is a 1989 model. It's a little newer. Very nice, light and bright, pretty open. This is very nice too. So if you're looking in Sarasota and you don't mind land lease, take a look at these homes. These are very, very nice. And let us know how we can help you. Susan Swanson Marketing at gmail.com. Very, very nice home. It's nice to see these mobile and manufactured homes renovated into the modern, you know, into the modern era because they're such nice homes. And a lot of the times with a mobile home or a manufactured home, it's if it's a double wide, two sides, one space. Single is a single, of course, and then you have triples, which are three sides or three sections to one home. But the two sides, one space, double wides are great. And if you have that middle wall between the living room and the dining or the kitchen, remove it or cut it in half, and that makes an incredible impact on the interior space. Now you're all wide open. It's great for conversation and family or friend gatherings. So just keep that in the back of your mind. It is not difficult to modify to the modern standards of today's living for these mobile and manufactured homes. So be sure and check some of these listings out. Um, some very, very fine homes. Here's another one. Now here's one that's 129. This one is in the Tri-Part tri -part, um, community up in Sarasota. This one's, now here's a great project for somebody. This one's listed for one, two, oh, no, I'm sorry, it's already pending. But if you're looking in tri -par, uh, there is a home available. The homeowner contacted me the other day. Um, it is over Brookfield Terrace, I think it's. I think that's the street it's on. I'm sorry, I don't have the notes in front of me, but that home is going to be priced around 140 or maybe a little bit below. Uh, that home has a lot of potential, and it's in the tri-part estates. That's real estate owned, so if you're looking for a mobile, that one I think was a 1970s model late 70s model, but don't quote me on that. But if you're looking in that community, email me today, Marketing at gmail.com, and I can give you some information on that home as well. So all kinds in the Sarasota area, but here's another new one. Nope, that one's pending too. Wow, they're just, fl 
Mobiles are flying off the shelves too. Unbelievable. Now let's see. Let's take a look at this one. This has got a green facade. This one, I'm trying to see where this one is. Camelot Lakes as well. This one's priced below fifty thousand. You guys, very sweet exterior. It's really green. Nice though. Wow, it's got a lot of bold color colors inside of it. That may need to be changed, um, but you know each to their own, but it's very nice. And this one's priced below $50,000. So they're, you know, you've got all different, all different price points, shapes and sizes in this community. Here's another one. This was less than 25,000. This one is, oh, it's not telling me. I don't like it when they do that. But anyway, uh, this one is below 25,000. Got a lot of furniture, but if you're looking for a deal and you want to modernize something, maybe that one's for you. So there are a lot of homes available. We're happy to help you, whether it's mobiles or manufactured homes, single family homes, a villa or a condo. We're happy to help you. Just know that. But take a look at these modern mobiles in Camelot Lakes on Realtor.com. The price was $155,000. It's pending. Just take a look at it. It's beautiful. And it just goes to show you what a mobile home or manufactured home would look like with a little bit of a modern touch. Gorgeous. Have a great day, everybody. And remember, if you're selling a home on your own, uh, I, I believe that you can do it. Don't get overwhelmed. But if you do get overwhelmed and it's just too much, we're happy to help you. But never show the home alone. I have a fit, healthy family member or friend with you at all times. You can have an evening open house to show the home in a whole new light. Uh, that's just a little tip of the trade. And uh, either way, we're happy to help you one way or the other. If you're coming to the Sarasota area, welcome. And I have to stress to you, have your ducks in a row. Have your finances in a row. Have your pen ready because homes are flying off the shelves as this, you know, even the manufactured mobile home sales are flying. So it's a good indicator. And if you did, if you checked out my last vlog, uh, the single family home sales in December 2020 alone increased 39.1%. That's amazing. And it's not slowing down. People are moving to Florida from all other areas. And you know, Sarasota County is no exception. So if you're coming to the area, we welcome you. We're happy to help you. And remember, don't pay too much. I'm seeing homes on the market that with listing and asking prices that are kind of crazy. We don't want to see the same thing happen as it did, you know, 10, 12 years ago. Don't overspend. Don't overbuy. Get the appraisal done first and uh, just buyer beware. And I hope you have a real good realtor working with you. And if you don't, let me know. My gal pal Alicia is fantastic. And uh, between the two of us, we're happy to help you. And if you're looking for manufactured or mobile home living, uh, we got people to help you in that realm as well. No worries, Susan Swanson Marketing at gmail.com. I hope you're having a great day. Feel free and welcome to subscribe to my channel. And if you are a subscriber, thank you so very much. Happy Coffee Cup Day to you. I hope your cup is filled with something delicious and strong. Have a great day, everybody. Let me know how we can help you. Susan Swanson Marketing at gmail.com. Check out these homes and have a great day.